Pat Love with Pat's Two Cents. Here to ask you, especially you men, not to be afraid. I know it sounds weird to say that to men when you really don't deal that deeply with your emotions. But I want to say to you, those of you who are the most abusive, who are the most volatile in your temperament, in your anger, do you realize a lot of it is the lack of confidence on your part? You're afraid. You're afraid of rejection. You're afraid of being alone. You're afraid of being out of control. That is a major fear. And sometimes you won't confront it. You know, the Bible says you shall know the truth and the truth shall set you free. But you have to acknowledge the truth first. There may come a time where you have to get alone before God cry your little eyes out and say Lord I am so afraid this petrifies me I don't know if I can handle that I don't know if I can deal with certain things and guess what God will begin a healing process but you first have to ask your family your wife and your kids please forgive you for all the times when you abused them and to acknowledge it as abuse and to tell them why. I'm telling you, you will enable them to heal as you heal. Do you realize that? That's why the Bible says, humble yourself under the, uh, under the hand of God and he will raise you up. Humble yourself, be honest, be real, be vulnerable, it's okay. You're safe when you're vulnerable in God's hands. No one can use it against you. God bless you as you reconcile with your family and as you reconcile with yourself.